We are going to transform Ever After High's Ashlyn Ella into our version of Strawberry Shortcake. She already has green eyes, so there's no need for a repaint. However, we will need new hair and clothes. So first, she's going to need a little haircut, using tweezers to remove the glue from the inside. We purchased our hair from dollyhair.com. They also sell a rerouting tool that was currently priced at $14. In our previous reroutes, we used a tool that we made in our Rainbow Dash tutorial using an X-Acto knife. On the website, there are many different types of hair, but we chose to go with a nylon hair, one called Sugarberry and the other Candy Apple. I take a little of both colors, pick a spot, place the hair next to the hole, and with the long side of the needle on top, I just drag a small amount over and then push it all the way in, then continue onto the next one. Apply fabric glue to the inside of the head and allow it to dry. To make the clothes, I will be using a t-shirt, a thin blue jean or cotton material, ribbon, hook and eyes, craft paint, and a needle and thread. Using some ideas from our doll Christmas sweater video, I take some t-shirt material, fold it over the doll's torso for size, add a little extra for seam allowance, then cut out two squares. Cut off the top corners, Measure and cut a piece of material that can fit around the doll's arm. With the fold facing up, I cut at the same angle as the top of the shirt. Lay out the pieces so the good side is facing down. I begin sewing them together on the angled lines. Starting with one side at a time, I match up my corners, then pick up the material so the good side is facing good side. Using a needle and thread, I begin an in and out stitch. Cut small strips of fabric, fold them in half, Line the edges on the right side of the fabric, then sew them on using a straight stitch. Continue on all the raw edges. When it is time to do the neck, I make a small slit at the top before continuing. Then I like to backtrack over all my edges by going in and over. Sew a hook and eye on the back of the collar, place it on the doll inside out, use pins to fit it to the doll's form, then sew down the sides, removing the pins as I go. Remove the shirt, then trim off the excess. Turn it right side out. Slide a small piece of paperboard into the shirt. I make a design using craft paint, then allow it to dry. Cut a rectangle of fabric that when folded can fit around the doll's leg with a little extra for a seam allowance. Fold it in half. On the side opposite of the fold, I cut a J shape, cut two, lay them good side to good side, stitch them together on one curve, open it, fold and hem the top, or I can add a folded strip of fabric like we did with the shirt. I chose to add two small pleats in the front by folding the fabric over. I roll up the bottom and iron flat, fold it over, sewing a small section of the lower curve, then I open and match up the ends, then sew straight across. Add a hook and eye to the back, sew eyes onto the top of the shorts, Cut two pieces of ribbon, sew hooks on one end, loop the hook through the eye, crisscross the ribbon in the back, and sew onto the shorts to make a pair of suspenders. We make a hat using our doll felt hat video, add a strawberry shaped button, we made a small bow, took another small piece of ribbon, and wrapped it around and glued it over a rubber band, glued a button on top, then placed it on a littlest pet shop to make her cat custard. So now, we would like to introduce our custom doll, Strawberry Ella. And you're done. Happy customizing!
Now let's take a look, Custard, in my very special mirror. Hat, strawberry colored hair, and oh, green eyes. Well, she could have chose brown, black, or blue. I've had them all. But wait, where are my freckles? You forgot my freckles. I thin out a little bit of craft paint with some water so I can add a few small dots. Then give them a few minutes to dry for instant freckles. We want to give a shout out to Pancake Power MSP. What's up? Now that's much better. I am very pleased. <laughs> See what I did there? Very? Because I'm strawberry? <laughs> uh, okay, never mind. 